another video of Simulink tutorial. Today's video is not about Simulink, but it's actually about MATLAB. Um, I was asked to make this video. So today's video is about how to write an output function in MATLAB. So let's see how to write an output function. So I already have written this output function. So let's see what I have typed in this function. So to write this output function, first we need the keyword function. After that, the output of the function and the name of the function is outfun. And I have passed three parameters to this function. That is x. x is a variable for an equation and optim values and state. Okay and stop is equal to false hold on and then plot x and in the end i have written draw now so we know we uh, write the command hold on generally to use in plotting the graphs so that previous output can be held and the new output can be plotted on the same graph then draw now Instead of end, at the end of the function, we have written draw now. So, what actually is the purpose of this command, that is draw now. It updates figure and processes any pending call. We generally use this command if you want to modify graphics object and wanna see updates immediately. So, that's why we are using this draw now command. And to see what outputs we are getting from this output function we will be using these commands so before going in much details I want to tell you a little bit about output function so an output function is the function called at each iteration of optimization function I have listed out this three optimization function that is fmn search then second f0 and fmn band and the function we want to optimize is x1 plus x2 plus x1 into x2 and why do we need an output function generally this type of function is used to see the history values and plot the data of function so let's see why we will be using this commands so this option it creates a structure for function handle of output function so to create the structure we will be using this command optim set output function and at the rate out fun which is the name of our output function hold on and object function is the equation that we want to optimize so we write it in this manner that is object function is equal to at the rate in bracket x and then the equation and in the end the optimization function that is fmn search in bracket object function that is the equation we want to optimize some graph limits and then this options which is the structure of our output function and this is the output that is x comma f val so so let's see how the output looks so i have this output function saved in the format of dot m file and it is in the current directory so i'll just be writing these commands in the command window so options hold on so when you do this hold on this graph figure is generated then the object function and after that optimization function with the arguments containing the structure of 
output function so this is what we get so what we understood is that output function is passed as an argument to optimization function and the key point to remember here is that using an output function you can view but not set the optimization quantities one more thing if you want to know more about this optimization function that is fm in band fm search and fm0 how do they work and what parameter we should pass as an argument to this function then you can search them in the help of matlab you'll get enough information about this optimization function so that's for this video if you like this video please give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel and if you if you want any video about any specific topic then please write it in comment section and thank you guys thank you for watching